Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to. Today we are going to do a review and demo of the Aria Beauty Marble Blow Dry Brush. This brush packaging is just so pretty. Um, so I wanna do a quick unboxing. My hair has been, you know, towel drying for a little while while I put my makeup on or anything, but that's how I normally do it. So I'm anxious to see um, how fast I can blow dry my hair with this blow dry brush. When you open it up, it looks like this. Super pretty, I love the marble. It has a nine foot cord, which I really appreciate because I hate when the cord's not long enough and you can't be where you wanna be in front of your mirror or you have to I don't know, move in weird ways because the cord's short. So this barrel is supposed to eliminate frizz, smooth your hair, and also create volume while you're blow drying. So I'm really excited to get started. I'm just going to section off my hair. Um, I just brought in a bunch of hair things. This isn't normally where I do my hair. So um, I'm just gonna section it off and then we'll get started. All right, so my hair is sectioned off. I'm kind of digging these little two buns on the top. I think it's gonna be a new style for me. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna throw on some heat protectant like I always do. And then I wanted to show you that there are three different settings. So you have high and then low and then air if you wanna do like a cool shot to set your style in place. So I'm just gonna get started. I am gonna let it play for a little while with the noise and then I'll add music and mute the blow dryer you don't need to hear that and I'll speed it up and everything but I want you to hear how loud it is I know it's hard on a you know whatever you're watching me on to really see how loud this is but let's check it out so here is air not too loud oh that's low even quieter and then high it's not the loudest thing it's not the quietest thing but it's not the loudest and this is very lightweight like this doesn't weigh anything. It looks, you know, heavy duty and, and like it's gonna weigh a lot, but it doesn't at all. All right, so I'm just gonna get started. Um, I would normally do my hair on high, so I'm just gonna do it on high. Okay, so that section was like a minute. Like I know that part I probably sped up for you guys and added some music so you don't have to hear nothing. Um, but it's totally dry. Like it's totally dry. And it feels so soft. And I don't see any frizz at all. All right, let's get the other side done. I wanted to stop and say I'm taking huge sections too, by the way, and it's, handling it just fine. And I also like the knob up top's not getting hot at all. It feels just like the base does. It's like a nice smooth um, feeling and it's not getting hot at all. So you can kind of guide, like I still like, even though it's a one-handed tool, I still like to use my other hand to kind of guide it along, but it's so much better than using a round brush and a blow dryer and trying to do all that. I'm trying to angle you guys a little better so you can see like the bottom. It's just falling so nice, like it's been dry. I just like that feeling of when you're putting, I don't know, the like the brush through your smooth hair. Like I could just keep going for hours. All right, let me take one section of my little buns down. And I have to add, like I did just put my hair through the ringer. Like I did currently go, um, did recently go full blonde on my own, like without Olaplex, I don't have anything. Um, I didn't have anything like that on hand and I just one day decided to go full blonde. Um, and my hair's handling it very well because it did, you know, there was some damage um, and this brush is doing wonderful. I can't wait to see the finished result. You know what's crazy too is I keep going like this and putting my hand behind it and it's not gonna burn the crap out of my hand. Like I've used a couple other blow dry brushes before and if you put your hand anywhere near this area or even slip when you're holding the top, like you're gonna burn the crap out of your hand. And that's not happening. So 
I'm just about to take my last um, crazy bun out, but like, look how smooth. There's no frizz. Like I have little baby hairs that broke from um, bleaching my hair, but it's so smooth. There's so much like life and bounce to it. I love it and it's going so fast. So let me just get this side down. I'm probably gonna split this section into two because it's really, really, it's a lot. Yeah, this is such a big section. What was I thinking? I was thinking that I really want to start blow drying my hair, so I went too fast. All right, last piece. Okay, so my hair is dry in a fraction of the time it would have took with a blow dry brush. I mean, with a with a round brush and a blow dryer. It saved me so much time, has so much like body and volume and life, and it's so shiny. There's zero frizz. I mean, I'm in the, like, I'm in August and it's like rainy and not nice out. And yes, I'm inside my house blow drying my hair, but my hair would still be frizzy. My hair doesn't care. I love it. Okay, so that is it. Um, I will link Aria Beauty and the, all their contact information down below and their website and their socials. And I also have a discount code for you guys. The code is hot hair. Um, it will save you 30% off anything you want on their website if you want to give them, uh, if you want to check them out. And yeah, I highly recommend this brush. It feels like it did the job. Like, and I was still able to go like I can touch this, and I'm not, I'm not getting burnt. Other tools feel like they are just so incredibly hot. I feel like this got the job done even better than some other ones I've tried and probably without less damage. Um, yeah, so let me know what you think in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!